we're going to be watching uh, the, the second part of the worst TV ads of all time. Uh, we did this last Friday or last Sunday, so we're going to be finishing it today. Kmart pants commercial. Ship my pants. Right here? Ship my pants, you're kidding. You can ship your pants right here. You hear that? I can ship my pants for free. Wow, I just may ship my pants. Yeah, ship your pants. Billy, you can ship your pants too. I can't wait to ship my pants, Dad. I just shipped my pants and it's very convenient. Very convenient. I just shipped my drawers. I just shipped my nighty. I just shipped my bed. If you can't find what you're looking for in store, we'll find it at Kmart.com right now and ship it to you for Is Kmart still in business? I don't think I've ever walked into a Kmart in my life. Maybe it's like a regional thing and they're just like not around me. All right, next one. That's it. That's his house. <laughs> Mr. Brad Haley. Relax. Did I win something? My sources tell me you've been calling Jack in the Box junk in the box. So? I take these things personally, Brad. Get lost. Sure. Just try my food, apologize, and I'll go. Beat it, clown. When I say I hate the f Jack in the Box uh, mascot, it has absolutely nothing to do with the f food chain, and it just looks stupid. It's just like a snowman with a f Ice cream cone on top of his head. It like it looks so dumb. Punk, I've spent millions of dollars improving my kitchens to make our best burgers ever. They're psycho. <laughs> they filmed. They said they had this ad on TV. Oh yeah, whoop them good, Jack. Uh, Brad, you get to try my best burger ever, and all I want is your honest opinion. Tasty. Really? You're not just saying that because I'm kneeling on your spine? No, no, I shouldn't have dished your food, man. I'm sorry, Jack. Well, I'm sorry about the grass stains. Really? No. Dude, that didn't even really feel like an ad. Like, it, that, se that seemed just odd. Choco Bell? Oh, no. I, I, I just don't know. How do they come up? Like, I, dude, it's all the Japanese commercials we've seen on this, um, like, list that we've been watching have just generally... Is this, is this Japanese? I don't know. Mo most of the Asian commercials that we've seen are just generally just, like, random. Like, they don't have to do with the product. It's just, like, let's, like, copy a PNG of some dude's face onto a walking chocolate ball, and then just call that the ad. And somebody came up with this idea. Like, somebody said this is a good fucking ad. Man. Oh, God, I hate this ad. I might just chill tonight. I remember watching this during the Super Bowl. Puppy monkey baby. Puppy monkey baby. Puppy monkey baby. Puppy monkey baby. Puppy, monkey, baby. Puppy, monkey, baby. It's just such a weird ad, and it's so obvious that they're just trying. Like, am I wrong in saying they're just trying to make something catchy and just make it really weird? So, like, they're trying to do two things. They're trying to make it so weird that it's memorable, which is just annoying. And they're trying to make it catchy when all they're saying is puppy, monkey, baby, which has nothing to do with fucking Mountain Dew. Puppy monkey baby, puppy monkey baby, puppy monkey baby. Puppy I would body slam that thing. Oh, 100%. If I saw this thing actually walking down the road, I would kill it. Is this another Choco Ball commercial? Yo, and you know damn well those things are trash. Like, you're about to eat, oh, go ahead, go ahead, Choco Ball. I'm about to eat that, bitch. It's going to make me throw up. It looks like a Whopper. It looks like a, it looks like a Whopper with different filling. Old Spice ad, oh, God. Pepperoni. Pepperoni. So where are we dropping? I saw this ad the other day. 
Why did they get Cypher PK to promote Old Spice? Honestly, though, kind of a smart strategy. Get a, get a really popular gaming creator to promote deodorant. Let's grab the audience that wears deodorant the least. Gamers. And so they now, you know, that's that's smart. Like, that's honestly smart. But I feel like Cypher PK, is he that famous? Like, I feel like the majority of the people that are going to see this ad don't know who Cypher PK is. Unless they targeted, like, Twitch and YouTube. I don't think this was, like, a TV ad. Actually, no, I think I saw it on TV. So where are we dropping? What is, what is this? What and, is? like, what the fuck is this thing in the back? Just gonna take a rip. Hold up, hold up, hold Sorry, up. chat. I forgot to put on my Old Spice deodorant, and this body odor is driving me nuts. Ooh. I just, like, smell like shit. Sorry, chat. It's just, like, every time I'm, like... I like my I like micro move. I just get a reek of my fucking bo, and I want to vomit. Even your play stinks. <laughs> Give odor the bird with the twenty four seven lasting freshness of Old Spice Eagle Fangs deodorant. That shit probably smells fucking putrid. You know when it's a blue stick that that shit is strong. Like you could smell it. You could open that Old Spice little fucking tube. You'll be 30 feet away and you'll smell it. So what are we playing? <laughs> Thanks. Today, I took the family to play on this. This is terrifying. This is utterly terrifying, bro. That looks like, that looks like Walmart Cinnamon. Took the family to play on the swings. <laughs> And I need more than one pair of hands at bedtime. Your behavior today was appalling! Oh, I'm so proud! New Pepper Army Nibblers. They're little bits of an animal. Uh, this little piggy went to market. What, what a slogan. God, that makes it seem so fucked up that we eat other animals. That would make me never want to eat that shit. Pepperoni nibblers. They're pieces of animals. It's pieces of an animal. God, when you put it that way, it's like, fuck, man. Like, I don't want to buy that. Like, if you're like beef jerky, it's pieces of a dead animal. This little piggy's dead home. This little piggy. Oh. <laughs> New pepperoni nibbler. Eating each other. This is literally like a cannibal ass. They're little bits of an animal. Pepperoni nibblers, little bits of an an- Say no to No Nut November. We gotta get some hobbies, dude. This No Nut November thing is brutal. Wait! No Nut November? Why deny yourself the pleasure of a good nut? Uh. Like, ugh. Ugh, dude. Like, it, it, I see what they're doing, right? They're trying to capitalize on the trend with nuts, but it's like, realistically, your marketing is probably supposed to be geared towards, like, people that are gonna buy the product. And the people that find, like, No Nut November funny are, like, 15, and they're not going to buy, they're not going to go out and buy whatever organic nuts this company is selling. Uh, Come on! How about you satisfy yourself with a nice nut right now? Together? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is, what, this was an ad? This was, this on TV? Orchard Valley Harvest. Holy shit. In front of you? Oh. Uh-huh. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. oh, I haven't had a nut like that in ages. Wait till you try the cranberries. Oh, the age smells good! Oh! oh my god, that's the worst and no, it's it doesn't beat it doesn't beat the one the one ad okay, the one ad that we watched last stream, they literally shoved a black guy in a fucking washing machine and he came out Asian. That was, that was the most fucked up ad. And there's your beautiful baby. Any day now. You're eating Doritos? He's eating Doritos on my ultrasound. Do you see what I have to do? I know. <laughs> oh, he's trying to grab him? Dude, that's honestly a pretty good ad. Oh, it's, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God, I remember this. She's going to give birth right here. <laughs> oh, give me that.
Dude, Doritos does good ads, though. Doritos does... See, like, that's a weird ad, but it's memorable. What's the name of this? Banned commercial for condoms? Oh, God. What do you do as a parent when your kid throws a tantrum like that? God, that's so annoying. Oh, that's so fucking annoying, dude. I'd be like, shut up. Holy fuck. Smack them? No, beating the shit out of them is not instilling that that's bad. It's just making them fearful. Just a brick to the face. <laughs> oh, it's so over. Oh, it's so over. <laughs> Use condoms. <laughs> Bro, is it not even for a specific condom? It's just like literally just a broad use condoms. Zazu condoms. Dude, that's honestly a good ad. That's like honestly a good ad. I'm so serious. <laughs> Super <laughs> Mario World 2 Yoshi Island. Much too much. To find out, we crammed oh. everything into Super Mario World 2 Yoshi's Island. 60 more levels, massive enemies, huge Yoshi tricks, all served up with the latest graphic technology, Morph Nation. Mm, no more. Sure you don't have room for another little bonus level? Uh-oh. <laughs> Super Mario World. Did he just die? Did he just fucking explode from eating so much? And all of his intestines just got all over the other customers. The two only on the Super NES. Still the big one. Another Doritos commercial. I feel like I haven't seen one Doritos commercial that I didn't like. <laughs> Yo, I knew it was going there too. I knew it was going there too. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be trash. Dude, it's a Mountain Dew commercial. Dude, I, am I wrong in saying Mountain Dew is the least healthy soda that you could ever consume? No, I think it's Monster. Monster is like death fluid. Monster has like 90 grams of sugar and 300 milligrams of caffeine. If you drank like eight Monsters in one sitting, you would actually die. Like you would, you would actually die. Sunny D? No, Sunny D just sucks. And I know that's a, I know people say that's a bad take, but Sunny D is just garbage, bro. It's just like shitty orange juice. Oh, what is she from? Always sunny in Philadelphia. Skittles umbilical cord Mother's Day TV commercial. Lemon. Uh-huh. Orange. Uh-huh. Oh, mother. I love eating Skittles every time you eat Skittles. I love you eating Skittles every time I eat Skittles. <laughs> <sighs> I miss Dad. Cut the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Happy Mother's Day. How do you set steak with a mandala? Yo, when they cut the umbilical cord, where is the tube? for the woman like it's your stomach your belly button but where do they like yank the tube out oh it's connected to the placenta so they just just 
Like one of those? I'm going to prepare something big that will inspire me to eat healthy. Be fine. More protein. Now we're going. Wow. Can we go now? Yo, that guy's like actually too big. Like that is like, dude, his calves are as big as my quads. Like that's like scary. Like he could probably like, honestly, I believe that man could fucking squeeze a watermelon with his fucking toes. Hilariously bad Pakistan Sonic Heroes Happy Meal commercial. God, dude, it looks like it was made on. This looks like some school project type shit. Like you would film this on on like fucking PowerPoint. Rogue and Emmy Dennis. Green puff flower catch. Shadow basketball. Shadow basketball. Knuckles baseball. जी भरकर फिर खेलें, खूब हल्ला गुल्ला मचाएं और दोस्तों को भी पतलाएं, चलो चल कर हैप्पी मील खाएं, चलो चले मिक्डॉनल्ड से सेका गेम्स लाएं। They ran this ad into the ground. This one sucks. I should probably tell you. I, I have Skittle Pox. Skittles Pox. Skittles Pox? Ew. 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 Are they contagious? I don't think so. Contract the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. Dude, I feel like they ran that ad for like two years. That or I saw it a million times. <laughs> Wait. Hmm? There's something I want to tell you. M minus two. I even I have something to tell you. Lasting relationships are based on transparency, like what Joe did. Yo, I don't understand two pays. I don't understand two pays. I that get it, dude. Rock the bald, or get a hair transplant, or rock the baldness, or like the balding, right? You can rock the psychowitz haircut from Victorious and look fire, right? If you're an old sixty-year-old guy, you got the fucking top. You got the top bald, like bald. All right. Oh my god. Let me sniff your beard now. Hold up, chat. I gotta go pee real quick. 